All right, so right now, when we have correction, it looks like this. Enable. It's not supposed to do that. Disabled. So yeah, that's exactly what's happening. And so we're gonna try and change the correction factors on this laptop here to make it, these are the correction factors here, um, to make it not oscillate, because that's oscillating and it's bad. All right, ready? Enabled. So Is that its drift? Back. That's good. So we want to make that higher. Disabled. Okay. So here we have a bunch of values. Um, they are P, they are I, they are D. Um, proportional integrated integral control. Derivative, sorry, control. Um, and so we take these little tiny factors and we apply them to the output on the robot. And if um, if we apply them to the output, then eventually it will correct it in a way that it should stand still, even if we try to move it. So the joystick, we're gonna use the joystick to try and make it move. If the factors are wrong, it will oscillate, it'll go back and forth trying to correct itself. If they're too small, it'll just go too slowly. It's really hard to tune properly, but we're gonna try and do it, because we're awesome. Okay. So I am going to enable it, and we're gonna see what happens. Enabled. That's oscillation, we don't want that. Disabled. So I'm gonna make that number smaller. Perfect. That's probably on camera. Nice. That's what's that? Yes. What does it do? It's corrupting. Look, I'm gonna, I'm boosting it. Try, it. try moving it. It corrects it. That's awesome. Oh my god, it works! Mm. Woo! It's auto-correcting. So if I turn it to the left, it'll go it'll back. It'll automatically turn back to where it was before. If I, if I just, eh. Is that because of the gyroscope? It's awesome. And you can see like it's slanted just barely, right? It'll auto-slant back to the right place. Approximately did not be aligned properly. That's pretty it crazy. It Watch. Isn't it cool? We have to tune it, but... A little bit. Yeah, yeah it works. All right, Rob, Rob, you cut, you like pulling stuff. Okay, so our robot doesn't like being rotated. It can be moved left and right, but it won't budge in terms of angle. It just refuses. We try to move it. A slightly older gyro, but I mean, for five minutes of tweaking and like just a couple days of code and an old gyro, this is fantastic. Imagine what we can do if we put like a couple more separate things. It moves, it moves forward and side to side, not perfectly easily. But rotating it, it refuses. It does not like that. So it's disabled now. And so I'll try to rotate it. Super easy. Super, super duper easy.